species. Community. That's messed up. So they killed him. My friend. It was then I knew that they'd gone too far. It was then that I realized what I had been party to. It took every last bit of magic I had gathered to bring him back. Then we ran. I just wanted to find a safe den where we could hide together, but... The squirrel sits quietly for a moment, running his hand down the cat's spine. Quirkus arches his back and flexes his claws. But Quirkus said we could do more. He said we should push on. I'm gonna pet Quirkus. The cat leans into your palm, rubbing against you, and only a quick act of acrobatics stops Solora from being knocked off. The squirrel throws his hands up in indignity, but you can see a quiet smile spreading <laughs> underneath his whiskers. What a bevy of misfits we are! Though I suppose it is best to fit badly in a world gone mad. Fear not, shield. I will discover how to stop the great acorn. Awesome, dude. I will protect the creatures of this land, all of them, from the knights. With Quirkus at my side, with you at my side, I know I will not fail. Hooray! You still, dude. The little girl doesn't acknowledge your. That quest is weird. I don't understand it. I don't understand it at all. Just sleeping girl in the bottom of my ship for all eternity, apparently. All right, might have to bring Sabeel down here. We might give her the executioner instead. <sighs> Hi, friends. How do we group up? Oh, right. Hey, can we talk to you guys? I thought you'd forgotten about me, darling. How goes your little endeavor? Got our way through the council. Almira gives you a devilish grin and traces her finger along your forearm. I had a feeling you'd be one to watch, my dear. I'm glad to hear my faith wasn't misplaced. It guys hurt so. difficult to get any work done with all this commotion lately. I hope there'll be fewer distractions from now on. Yeah, fart noise is on you, sir. On. Gareth still on the ship? Hi, ship friend. Let's do us a speaking. You know that lady managed to lead Dallas to you. Yeah, I want to call this yes. out. I am sorry. She had me built to her exact designs. Not even oh. I know all the ways in which she can control me. She was able to follow my wake like a shark. But I will see myself destroyed rather than be forced to betray you again. I swear. It shall be done. Melody. Friend. Melody's face is drawn. She seems tired, somewhat subdued. She looks you over and squints. What's wrong with you? You seem happy. Tell her you think you're in love. <laughs> no better, no worse than usual. If you insist. I've had some time to think, and there's a few matters I want to discuss before we carry on. I doubt you've forgotten the death of Meister Siva. She swallows hard and closes her eyes for a moment, as though trying to dispel a dizzy spell. She and I had a deal, you see. A deal that's now quite obviously defunct. According to its terms, I was to help you ascend to divinity, and she was to help me with another matter. The details aren't important now, it's just... Never mind. Another entangling alliance. But I won't be able to disentangle it on my own. The name
may come a time when I need to count on you as an ally. So, sure. Are we? Allies, that is. Oh man. Don't make me do something bad, Malady. I want to know what this entangling alliance you're referring to is. The details are detailed. Suffice it to say that Meister Siva believed she could help me. And I believe you're twice the sorcerer she ever was. So? Uh, uh. All right, fine. Your problems are my problems. Hmm. That's something I don't often hear. Thank you. Please don't betray me or be bad, Melody. That will break my heart. I found out where Dallas is heading. There's a great city not far from Driftwood, Arx by name. Aha! It's controlled Arx. by Magisters, so you'll have your work cut out for you. We have to find out what she's planning to do with the powers of the Seven. We'll need to find her and take back what she stole, and quickly, before she does something irreversible. Dallas, or any of the others for that matter, cannot be allowed to use the powers of the gods. She doesn't understand what must be done. She doesn't understand how to rule. She thinks I know how to rule? Given the alternatives, I consider you our very best mm. bet. It's quite simple, really. Chaos is a fact of life, surer than any other. Power is one of the few structures that can cut a line through that chaos. If wielded well, that line will mean stability, order, a comfort against the unknowable, changing forces of chaos. If wielded poorly, the line will mean domination, terror, different from chaos, but no better. Dallas and the others like her, Alexander, the Mother Tree, the Prince of Shadows, they are little better than demons, really. They seek power at the expense yep. of others, not to create stability, but to create servants. Look at my face, God Woken. What do you see? Do you? I suppose we all see what we want to see. When I look in the mirror, I see balance. Balance between darkness and light, between good and evil. Whatever those categories mean. When the time comes for you to ascend, remember my face. Remember that despite any shortcomings you might have, if you can bring a semblance of balance to the world, you'll have done as good as the Seven did. And if you can be stronger than them, you'll do all the better. The Seven are gone, slain by their god Woken, slain by you. You have the potential, the obligation even, to do better than they did, to create a better world than the world they made. Yeah, I want to say I'm surprised. I am surprised I that she's talking this way. I know what evil is, God Woken. I've seen what chaos can do. It isn't how I picture Rivalon's future. You are my insurance against that. Now, there's little time to spare. We need to get you to Arx, find Dallas, take back what she stole. Shall we go? Now, to Arx. Good. How lucky for you I'm on your side. I'm probably the only one masterful enough to transport an entire ship safely between the land of the dead and the land of the living. Captain Malady stands at the ready. Oh, please don't make her be bad. That will so break my heart. Are you going to do anything, game? There it goes. After the briefest moment of respite, Malady brought the Godwoken to Arx to recover the divine powers Dallas had snatched away. But the half demon's secret was taking its toll on her. Oh, oh, Lucian, fools! The boss is going to ruin everything! Freeze! 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 No, oh, I'll feel, feel even worse if she dies. No, please, 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 please. Oh. There are very few people in this game that I don't want to lose, and she's one of them. Malady Sabiel Losa, 
I'd feel bad if Fane dies because he's hilarious. But I wouldn't be like, nope, like the other three. Red Prince is a douche. I felt nothing for him dying. Beast, I kind of felt bad because he was just a dude. Ooh, the load time. Awesome. So what are you doing up so late, Viking? If you're still here. The Wreck of the Titan achievement. It has a picture of my ship. Did my ship die? About to crash out. Cool, cool. I appreciate you being here, man. Don't say anything. <laughs> yeah, she just uh, ran that to ground. She's badass. Malady groans, her face twisting in pain. She falls to one knee, catching herself on her hands. I'm gonna help her up. She raises one hand and raises herself to her feet. Figured she'd do that. Now, now, no need to fuss, I'll be fine. It's just that traveling between the realms isn't easy, you know? It takes something from my soul each time. But never you fear. Oh no, that's not a good sound. Out of my sleeve. The Lady Vengeance stands in two realms at once. Her body here, her soul in the Hall of Echoes. You can still return at your leisure. Oh. At least I got us where we wanted to go. This is Arx. This is where Dallas has fled with the powers of the gods. This is where the path to divinity leads. What comes Dallas next? Must be stopped. She has stolen the powers of the Seven. You need to get the Aetirin back if you're to fight the God King. You'll need it if you're to ascend. Track her in arcs. Find out where she's gone and end her. Take back the Atiran and the powers of the gods with it. You cannot fail, Godwoken. Not for anything. Hey, Chief. Before we get a move on, I'd like a word with Malady. You might. Sure. Psst. Hey, Mal's. I'm not, you know, feeling. So no. No. I should think not. The demon is getting closer to himself. You'll meet him in Ark soon enough, and if you meet him like this, it's bye bye, Losa. No. Um. We won't let that happen, will we? I've got a little something cooking. There's power in names, after all. And we know exactly who a drama leak is. Don't worry. I'll find you before it's too late. Demon's on it. I love her. She's so cool. Alright, what do you got to say, squirrel? <gasps> Might have been a butcher, true, but she still made a noble home. And now our nest is gone. We cannot hide in their barren hall of echoes. We cannot idly wait for fate to take us. There's only one thing left to do. Solora looks up to you, then back to Quercus. His whiskers twitch. We must fight! Onward, Quercus! Onward, shield! Until the great acorn drops, there's still hope! Is he actually gonna help me fight oh. now? No. Alright, I wanna go... Uh... <laughs> Wait a minute. Can I not respect anymore? Uh oh. The statue reaches toward the sky as the bottom drops out from within. Uh oh. She lifts you up, up, up. Hall of Echoes.
Ah, oh, thank goodness. Almira. Almira has a red thing on her. Let's go check her out in a second. All right, Sabiel. Time for you to touch this. Night, man. Good to see you. Hopefully, uh, I caught you in time. Talents. Pet pal. Uh, we're gonna do... What was it? Fusioner. Oh, that's incompatible with the pawn. That's a bummer. Hmm. Holy crap. Oh, yeah, that doesn't work. Opportunist? No. No. I don't know what I want for her. I guess bigger and better. Oops. Wait a minute, did it not give it to me? Attribute points. Okay, whatever. All right, let's get everyone in here and just make sure. I think I might get rid of Stanch on Loza. All right, she has that. No, she doesn't. Okay. Never mind. We need to save. Game is crazy laggy now. I do not know what the deal is. Anything is starting to run again because it's awful. See anything? Just running like crap for some reason. I don't understand. It's weird. All right, they said her soul is still here, cause I, so I kind of want to go see if her head is still here to be talked to. Ship friend. You're lucky that I enjoy a bumpy ride, my dear. Our arrival here was vigorous, even for my tastes. I'm still eternally grateful for all you've done for me, of course. In cool. fact, here, take this. I suspect you'll find use for it soon enough. I want to know if I'm going to oh, throw I gave you my word, didn't I? I've been this to Arx. Place? No. Arx is clogged with divine order lackeys, from what I understand. It's not the sort of town where a girl like me could let her hair down, unfortunately. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. Travel. Alright, so I'm gonna save real quick and I'm gonna restart the game because this is crazy. The amount of lag is insane. Like, look at this. I can't even choose quit game. Because it's still trying to save. Something is goofy. Jeez. What is going on? Hopefully that helped. Oh, the lovely loading screen is going to be coming up again. We could just call the stream here because of the issues we've been having. Hmm. Hmm. All right. This will be my decision. Depending on how this is running. That will be my decision. If it's super laggy when we go in, we'll call it. And then hopefully it'll have resolved itself tomorrow. <sighs> Do a couple more restarts or something. I don't know what the heck is happening. But it is definitely being a problem. OBS is just eating a crap ton of resources for some reason. And I can't understand why. It makes no sense. Hmm. The game is still trying to load, so I'm thinking that's our cue. Yeah. I don't know what's going on, so I think we're going to call it here, my friend. Sorry for the late stream, but even look, right now I'm not even doing anything, and the webcam is all jittery. So I don't know what the problem is tonight, but thank you guys for putting up with the issues. Sorry for the no sound effect for like the or no game sound for the first hour, even though OBS was reporting that there was sound. That's very obnoxious, but I appreciate you guys being here. Hope you guys are liking it. If you are, remember to like, subscribe, comment. It helps me out a lot. Let's me know what you're liking, what you're not liking. Um, we're going to be playing some more tomorrow. We may only have a day or two left, depending on how big arcs is. It sounds like it's just the final arc, arc of the game, and maybe there might be just a few quests that we can do. Um, before whatever happens at the end. But yeah, we'll continue tomorrow. Um, remember to spay and your pets, adopt, don't shop, donate to rescue if you can afford it, or open up your house up to the possibility of fostering. That is, oops, excuse me, a very rewarding experience and helps those animals and rescues out that very much in need. Anyway, I'm Vasive. Thank you for tuning in with me, and I'll catch you next time. See ya.